is so American. We pretty much live here now, so. So many things you can eat and try here. We're Matt and Nat, a part-time, non-remote travel couple based out of Nashville, Tennessee. In 2021, we visited all 50 U.S. states. 2022 took our adventures abroad. Now we've set out on a journey to see as many of the 1,000 places to see before you die. Well, before we die. In our last video, we were in Daytona Beach, Florida, where we got a behind the scenes look at the Daytona International Speedway. Went on a wildlife cruise where we took in the area's natural beauty along the Intracoastal Waterway. And finished our day with sunset dinner and drinks. This week, we're visiting the world's largest gas station. Welcome to Bucky's. We're here in Sevierville, Tennessee, where the iconic Texas chain Bucky's recently opened the largest gas station in the world. Now, when we heard that the largest gas station in the world was less than three hours from our house, you guys know that we had to come and experience the craziness. Now, a little bit about this place before we dive in. It is 74,000 square feet, has 120 gas pumps, a 250 foot long car wash, <laughs> as well as all of the other things that you would expect out of any Bucky's location, like incredibly clean restrooms and a plethora of interesting snacks and gifts. Today we're going to give you a tour of this massive place, along with showing you some of the top foods that you guys need to try when you come to Bucky's. And we haven't really eaten all day in preparation for this, so let's get going. station when you need a grocery cart or as we would say here in the south a buggy a buggy yeah i've never called it a buggy in my life i call it a cart what do you guys call it buggy. no it's a cart Okay, so I'm very overwhelmed. There's so many people here. This Bucky's opened like two weeks ago, so yeah. it is packed. Absolutely insane here. But for the food, since there is literally so many things you can eat and try here, we've decided the best approach here is to take it in courses, and we're gonna start with appetizers. Let's go. Largest one dollar and nineteen cents. This is a small. It's ninety nine cents. Okay, so we found three out of the four snack items. <laughs> the one that we were really looking for and searched the store over and over for was their sizzling saltines or their ranch and saltines, which are essentially just flavored saltine crackers. Heard that they were incredible, but we talked to a manager and he's been told that they are discontinued at least temporarily. Yeah, now at the Daytona location <laughs> where my parents live, they have them there, yeah. so. So it's just hit or miss right now, but I will be putting all of these, even the possibly discontinued items in our blog. So check Check out that. We'll have a whole list of all the foods that you have to try when you come to Bucky's. You guys are literally on our cart right now, so. 
Okay, so we have been to Bucky's before, but not the world's largest. No, and we haven't tried all of these food items. Mm -hmm. I think the only one that I have tried out of what we have now is the beaver nuggets. I've tried the nuggies, but I've had the white cheddar, which I highly recommend <laughs> so good. I've never tried the bold and spicy. So let's dive in. So this is essentially the savory version of the beaver nuggets, and it's the Bucky's mm -hmm. nuggies. Cheers. <laughs> oh. Mm -hmm. My gosh, I'm not usually like a bold and spicy person, but these are so good. They're like a salty, little bit of spice. Got, got some a, smoke to got it. A smokiness to it, and the texture is very mm. light and airy. These are so addicting. Uh huh. Recommend. A win. These. Moving on to the Bucky's Nuggies sweeter cousin. No, 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 no. I need my 99 cents icy. Now, given I have had these before, um, and not just had them, I've had multiple bags of these before. Palate cleanse. So these are the sweet sister to the Bucky's Nuggies, mm -hmm. kettle corn kind of version of them. So the, good. The inside is still super light and airy, mm -hmm. but that outside, because it's sugary, gives it a crunch on the outside, so good. Oh. I'm a recovering addict from these though, so I gotta recovering stop. Recovering addict? <laughs> remember how Not many, recovering. Remember I used to always get a bag when I would drop by a Bucky's. I'd never been to a Bucky's before and he brought those home. <laughs> On to the jerky. We ended up getting what the gentleman behind the jerky counter said was their most popular, which is their Bohemian garlic beef jerkies. And then we also got these sweet and spicy. Oh my gosh, look how big this is. Which one's that one? Sweet and, oh, spicy. Sweet and spicy. Here's the Bohemian garlic. Mmm. <laughs> that is quality beef jerky. Mm. This one's got a nice pepperiness to it. Of course, garlic that's in the name, but the garlic's not overpowering. It's got a nice pepperiness to it, which I really love. And this one's not too spicy. I do love the sweet hint to it. I love that it's not extremely tough either. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's jerky, but sometimes jerky can be just even tough to eat. I'm a happy girl. Lived up to the hype. So one of the best things about Bucky's is that you can eat <laughs> and shop. But there's also no seating anywhere in here to eat yeah. or outside. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of convenient to have the court to just be able to eat and shop. Now I think we should go shopping. For what? More food? No, no, no. Shopping <laughs> for some, maybe some clothes, some hats. Maybe we can buy some postcards. Patrons, so maybe we're gonna do that, <laughs> and then we'll go for round two for food. All right, sounds good. Come with us. What if you just shopped with me like this? <laughs> This is my kind of shopping. You can smell the barbecue, the roasted nuts. The only way I'll do it from now on. <laughs> subscribers suggested that we buy a cowhide rug. I don't know if we'll, we'll do that this trip, but you can if you want to. <laughs> dress that had buggies on it, I would have bought it just for this video. I haven't seen it yet, so we'll see. So they do have another section full of clothes that don't have Bucky on it. But what's the fun in that? Exactly. See, that's cute. And then when people go, where'd you buy it? I say Bucky's. <laughs> So we found this sweet Beaver Bucky's keychain. So if you guys want it, leave a comment down below. We're gonna pick one and send it to you. Now it's time for an actual meal. So let's go get some lunch. Let's go. chopping it up and putting <laughs> sauce on it. It's my favorite. <laughs> It's 
that good eyes too. Very overwhelming. <laughs> that should be their motto here because it's a lot. It's a lot. So we're gonna go eat now again via our cart. So let's go. <laughs> First step is the kolache. Now I've heard that pronounced multiple ways, kolache or kolache. Either way, it looks delicious. We heard they're awesome. And this is the cheese, sausage, and jalapeno. jalapeno. It's a lot doughier than I thought it was gonna be. Oh, it has a, like a, a wiener it has in like it? It's like a sausage, yeah. Oh, okay. Give it a go. <laughs> mm. Oh, the spice. Now this is in the bakery section, so you have to ask somebody to get it. Ooh, that's real good. Right? That dough is super mm. soft. It's got a nice chewy texture to it almost. It does, like, and it's that sweet bread. Yeah. That sweet dough, oh my gosh. It's not super sweet though. No, but like Texas Roadhouse, those kind of sweet it, rolls, they're <laughs> sweet rolls, yeah. Very good. I'm a fan. <laughs> I do want to shout out these amazingly huge drinks for a dollar and 39 cents. 36 ounce probably. Extra large. Extra large. I love that Buggies does all of their own sodas and they've got pure cane sugar in them. Yep, we went so with many the flavors. what? Black cherry soda. I haven't had it before. Oh my gosh, it's so good. I just want to go and try each one of them, but there's so many people, you have to like mm. commit to it. I was thinking it was going to be more like cherry Coke, but it's, it's not. not. It's just a cherry soda. I don't think there's any cola. They I, do have like a strawberry though. lemonade that I'm dying to try, so that might be my next one. All right, up next is the chopped brisket sandwich. Now I'm going to go ahead and tell you, I have had this multiple times. I've had it multiple times because it's delicious. <laughs> I have gotten the sliced brisket as well. It's not as saucy or not as greasy either, but this this one, this chop is absolutely delicious. Fan favorite. Mm. Oh my gosh. Smoky, mm. saucy, delicious goodness. Those Texans know how to do barbecue. <laughs> All right, I can't fill up on that yet. We've got one more <laughs> dinner item. Fried chicken, baby. <laughs> now this is Natalie's favorite. Anytime we go to Bucky's, the fried chicken sandwich is what she's going for. <laughs> it has a sauce on it, so literally you just go. Pick it up and go. Give it a go. Ooh, that one looks really good. You get a lot of meat. <laughs> yeah, that's a nice patty of chicken. I love the sauce that they put with it. It's just a really well done piece it of is. fried chicken with a delicious house-made sauce on it. Breading is nice and crispy on it. It hadn't gotten soggy from the sauce, no. which means it's probably pretty fresh. It didn't sit there for long. I mean, a fan. <laughs> We're gonna go finish our dinner now because it's gonna be dessert time soon. <laughs> and you're looking good. So if you guys like videos like this, please make sure you give it a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. And shout out to our patrons. We weren't able to find any postcards for you here, but that doesn't mean we didn't get you some little goodies for our Patreon trivia prizes. And if you're interested in joining our Patreon and supporting this channel in a greater way, check out our Patreon page. The link is down in the description. Now on to dessert. My favorite. <laughs> So definitely check out the bathrooms. There are 35 <laughs> stalls for the women and they are so clean. Natalie came out of the bathroom and asked me, how many stalls were in the men's bathroom? I was like, I don't know, I didn't count. I counted them because usually there's a line for the women's and there's never a line at Bucky, so hit it up. <laughs> I want warm nuts, so I went way back there. Oh my gosh, so heavy. That's got some substance to it, like that is heavy. Scented candle. See if it really smells like it. It's like a caramel beaver nugget candle. <laughs> That's when you know you're committed to the Bucky's movement when you get a beaver nugget candle. No chai latte or hot chocolate, but no. I won't hold that against them. They do have tons of coffee, big vats of iced coffee. Now that we got the goods, we're headed back to our little quiet corner to <laughs> eat. <laughs> so we're just gonna start with the thing that we know and love. <laughs> Which is the roasted pecans. Honestly, any of the candied nuts, yep. we just prefer the pecans. Yeah, cheers, ooh, they're still a little warm too. Oh my God. I love these so much. So sweet, mm. so nutty, delicious. Yeah. 
next we're going for dessert in a cup. So this one came highly recommended from a lot of people. So let's give it a go. Banana pudding in a cup. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad for gas station I mean, dessert. Yeah. Mm. Is it the best banana pudding I've ever had? No. Is it the best gas station banana pudding I've ever had? Yes. Absolutely. Yes. It's actually really good though. Mm -hmm. I could definitely eat this whole thing and not be upset. They do have smaller serving sizes. And when Natalie grabbed the big one, I said, do you want to grab one of the small ones? And she was like, no, I put I... a big one in the car. <laughs> he was judging me. <laughs> Get it. Get it. Put in your cup holder and eat it while you're driving. <laughs> All right. I'm not going to fill up on that. Okay. Because we have one final dessert item to wrap this thing up. No, we don't. We have two more. What? We oh, we fudge. do. I forgot. We got four dessert items, not three. <laughs> Let's do the fudge first. Okay. You want to do the fudge? Yeah. So their most popular was the peanut butter, but we did not get it. <laughs> yes. Only reason we didn't get it is because they didn't have it already like pre-cut and ready to go. Yeah. And the, and the line was kind of long. And we had heard this was really good. The birthday cake fudge. That is so sweet. Is it? It's very good, but man. Whoa. I'm not really a fudge person, and I don't know why. It's it is good. good. Yeah, it is good, though. It is so overwhelmingly sweet, though. I could only do like a few bites of that. Let us know your favorite flavor if you've had the fudge here at Bucky's. That's good. I am mad at it. Cleanse the palate a little bit with some more sugar. <laughs> <laughs> I love this place. It's just so American. All right, and the grand finale of this Bucky's dessert round is the cake balls. I believe she said it was wedding cake, chocolate, and red velvet. I think this is the wedding cake, right? Like a cake pop. I think this one has some coconut in it, so you probably will not like it. I'm not a huge coconut fan, guys. But I just love the texture of oh, like cake pop. Oh, these are heavy yeah. cake pops, too. Love the texture. Honestly, it's really good. Right. I think I prefer that over the fudge that we got. Moving on, I think this is the red velvet. Ooh. Is that good? Look at the red velvet. Should be chocolate. It's got a coarse salt on the outside. Here we go. Salty, right off the oh, bat. Oh, is it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Got a very rich chocolate cake inside. It's very salty on the side. But I can see how it goes well together. Mm -hmm. I do. My favorite out of the cake balls. One, two, three. Red wedding cake. velvet. Bucky sign highly recommend <laughs> pulling off and checking it out because it is an experience all on its own that it is but that is going to end our time at the world's largest gas station we hope you enjoyed following along if you did please remember to hit that big thumbs up button and comment down below your favorite Bucky's items and we'll see you guys next week oh that lay is rough yeah Woo! <laughs> instant cavity it's like opening a package for Christmas. Because this yeah. is great for people watching. <laughs> the only spot that's like not crazy. Oh, not that one. <laughs> okay, pro tip. Get a Dr. Pepper Icy, drink it halfway, and then get a cherry drink and pour the Icy into this. So good. Ooh, that's tough. Thick. Thick.